Hi, Josh Apple here with the Raspberry Golf Academy. Today I'm at Virginia Golf Center and I'm going to talk about one of my favorite drills for speed training. I'm going to start with a heavy club, which I have here in my hands. If you don't have a heavy club, you can use two or three of your regular golf clubs. But we're going to start with controlled swings with something heavy to build up your strength. So I would do maybe 10 to 12 swings right-handed, and then I would actually switch to the lefty side and swing lefty as well. Again, 10 to 12 swings, both sides, build up that strength, slow controlled swings with something with a lot of weight. Then I would go to something extremely light and go for absolute top speed. I have here just an alignment rod. So there are different products on the market for speed sticks. But this is just a simple, cheap product, alignment rod, has almost no weight to it. And again, I'm going to do 10 to 12 swings both sides, righty and lefty, going for as much speed as I possibly can. And you want to hear the whip on both sides. Whip that way, whip back, and back swing. So look like this. Notice it whips on both sides, and you would want to do the same thing on the other side. So the reason why I train both sides of the body is functional movement, overall strength, speed, just basic coordination, uh, agility, both sides of the body. So anything you do in the gym, I recommend doing that as well, both sides of the body, anything golf specific, rotation specific. So anyway, you do your heavy and then you do your light and fast. And then I go back and forth. I would go back to the heavy and back to the light, three sets. So 10 to 12, heavy, light, heavy, light, heavy, light. And then you get your regular golf club and start hitting just regular golf shots, traditional weighted club. And you'll see an increase in speed and power. And I'm ready to put that effort, that energy into this golf ball. Generally, I'll do three sets, like I said, of heavy, light, heavy, light, heavy, light. And then I'll hit and might hit 10 or so shots and then go back and do three sets again. And that's a great way to work on speed training, especially in the winter uh, when you're doing uh, mainly indoor work like this, hitting into a net, a uh, great time to work on your club head speed and power. I'm Josh Apple and that's your tip of the day.